what's up how are you are you doing well i really hope you are today i'm getting my first shot of the vaccine uh, i'm kind of nervous about it but i i'm positive that it's gonna go well and i'll take you with me as much as i can so yeah enjoy this vlog i'm really nervous so fucking nervous It's getting real, guys. It's getting real. <laughs> All good, though. All good. We are waiting. All done. Yay, yay. Look. Okay, it's been one day since I got the vaccine. I don't know why my voice is like that, but I'm, I'm fine. Um, I had my hand hurting where the needle went in, which is normal because even like the, the simple uh, flu shot hurts, so yeah, it's fine. Today I woke up feeling kind of funny, my head was feeling uh, weird, I, I was really dizzy and my stomach was feeling funny, but other than that I didn't have fever and my body wasn't hurting. Hopefully it stays away. The nurse uh, said that, that the first 10 days are important, mostly the first 48 hours, but if the, any of the symptoms continue beyond 10 days, you should contact your doctor. Hopefully my symptoms won't continue and I won't have any more symptoms. Uh, my tongue is blue because I was drinking Powerade. Um, but yeah, uh, that's the update after the, the first uh, vaccine shot. It's been 28 days since the first part of this video was filmed, which means it's time for my second shot of the vaccine. And to be honest, I'm really nervous, but I'm also like kind of looking forward to being done with it. So yeah, we will see how it goes. The clock is ticking, it's getting closer and closer and I'm getting nervous, but at the same time, as I said, I just want this to be over with, so let's go do it. Ready for round two! Day two after the vaccine. Yesterday after I got the vaccine, my mom and I went to run some errands and then we came home and did some more things that needed to be done. With the heat, I started feeling quite dizzy, so I went to, to sleep. I woke up late at night, uh, early in the morning, if you want to call it that. Um, I stayed up for a while and then I went back to bed because I had work in the morning and I needed to get some sleep. But then again, I slept the entire day, so that doesn't make sense, but you get what I mean. It's a good night's sleep, so yeah. Other than feeling dizzy and my hand hurting, I haven't had any other symptoms. I'm feeling quite well. Let's hope that continues. Um, I'll update you throughout the day. So it has been a couple of days since I got the second dose and I'm fully vaccinated. Other than the dizziness and the headache, uh, which could also be a side effect of the heat and not only the vaccine but they are symptoms of the vaccine so i'm mentioning uh, them 
I also had like my stomach was feeling kind of funny uh, but other than that I didn't have any symptoms and it was it, it all went away quite uh, fast and quite easily and I'm very grateful for that I got vaccinated by choice but also not by choice like I I would have waited a bit to do it but I, I didn't quite have the choice 100% due to medical reasons I had to get vaccinated um, I'm glad it went well and I didn't have any other symptoms more serious symptoms I do encourage people to get vaccinated but I I encourage people to do it by choice and not to feel pressured into it or you know do it for the wrong reasons because many people do it for the wrong reasons and that's not um, it's not something you can take so lightly and it's not something you can just decide on and you know never look back you have to to be certain you want to do it so yeah other than that I'm well I'm fine uh, it's all over now and I hope that by getting vaccinated we will you know push COVID further away even though I don't see it happening let's be honest but I want to remain just a bit optimistic uh, but anyways get vaccinated if you want to uh, do it responsibly do it by choice do not let anyone pressure you into it do it for the right reasons and if you don't want to for any reason at all then don't um, your opinion is your opinion matters and your health is your own so you are responsible for your health and your life so you know do it at your own time if you decide to other than that um, I don't know, I hope you enjoyed this vlog and I'll see you in the next one.